two, three, four. I know God made me And I know God loves me And He knows What's best for me Cause He knows Every single thing And I believe His promise is true Cause everything He says He will do On a Sunday, Monday, Tuesday Question one, who is God? God is our creator and king. Why can we trust God? We can trust God because he is faithful and does everything for his glory and our good. Does God keep his promises? God always keeps his promises. Is there anything God cannot do? God can do all things according to his character. What is God like? God is holy, good, and loving. What is worship? Worship is celebrating the greatness of God. What does it mean to sin? To sin is to go against God and his commands. 
How can we glorify God? We can glorify God by loving him and obeying him. What is repentance? Repentance is turning away from sin and turning to Jesus. Is anything or anyone greater than God? No, God is greater than everything and everyone. How is Jesus the perfect king? Jesus perfectly rules over the universe as the king of kings. What does God know? God knows everything about the past, the present, and the future. How many gods are there? There is one true God who alone deserves worship. Why should we obey God? We should obey God because he made us, he loves us, and his plans are good. How did God plan to fix what sin broke? Before he created the world, God planned to send the Messiah to save sinners. Why do we pray? We pray because we trust God and we know he hears us. How is Jesus the perfect prophet? Jesus perfectly reveals God the Father and fulfills what the prophet spoke. Hey friends, I'm Megan. And I'm Jessie. Hey Megan, my mom asked me to give you this. Oh, what is it? Oh, Jessie, that's so sweet. Your mom sent me a note to thank me for taking you and your brother ice skating. And she's inviting me to come to your house for hot chocolate. I know, I hope you can come soon. Me too. Hey, you know what? What? You kind of acted like a prophet today. A prophet? How? Wait, what's a prophet? I can't remember. <laughs> a prophet in the Bible was someone who God used to give his messages to the people. God would tell the prophet what he wanted to say to the people, and then the prophet would tell the people what God said. Oh, but how was I like a prophet? Your mom gave you a message, and you gave it to me. Oh, I guess I did act like a prophet. Yep. Today's Bible story is about the prophet Zechariah. Let's hear what God had to say to his people through Zechariah. Listen to the story. When God's people stopped rebuilding God's temple, God sent prophets to give his people a message. Zechariah was one of the prophets who told the people what God said. God said, come back to me and I will come back to you. God wanted his people to remember him and put him first. Do not be like your parents and grandparents and great grandparents, God said. I sent prophets to tell them to stop disobeying me, but they did not listen. One night, God gave Zechariah more messages for his people. The messages came in eight visions, like dreams, but Zechariah was awake. Each vision was a new message that said what God was going to do. Zechariah saw a man on a red horse. 
The man rode his horse around the earth. He looked to see what was happening. Everything was quiet. God said he was going to punish his people's enemies, and the people would finish building God's temple. Then Zechariah saw four horns. God's people had four enemies. Zechariah saw four men. The men would win against the enemies. Then Zechariah saw a man with a rope. He used the rope to measure things. The man tried to measure the city of Jerusalem, but it was too big. Then Zechariah saw Joshua the priest. Then he saw a golden lampstand, and then a flying scroll. Then Zechariah saw a woman in a basket. Then he saw four chariots. What strange visions! Everything Zechariah saw in the visions was a special message from God. God told Zechariah, "Make gold and silver crowns." Put them on Joshua the priest. Joshua looked like a king, but he was not the special king God planned. God said the true special king would come one day and bring peace. There would be no more fighting. Be happy and shout for joy. Your king is coming. God said he is a good king. He is riding on a donkey. Zechariah saw that God was going to help his people and give them a special king. Jesus is the king who came humbly on a donkey, just like Zechariah said. God kept his promise to send Jesus. We can trust in Jesus to forgive our sins. I know God made me, and I know God loves me, and He knows what's best for me, 'cause He knows every single thing, and I believe His promise is true, 'cause everything He says He will do. On a Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. <laughs> Cause everything he says he will do <laughs>